whilst I was working, the people there were teaching me about Islam and I was really intrigued to know about it. As, as a Christian, nothing made sense to me until I came to Islam and everything I learned answered all my questions. And I f woke up one morning and I was like, I want to revert, I want to put the hijab on. And from that very day, I never took my scarf off to this day now. Um, my auntie and my uncle didn't actually accept me for who I am. They had kicked me out on the streets, so I had nowhere to go. There was a few nights where I would do like all-nighters in the park where I had no one, just my suitcase and myself, that's it. I ended up going back onto the streets once I got to Sydney, but I didn't have anyone to turn to. My dad just recently went in jail. My sister lives overseas. Um, my mum neglected me as a baby, so I had no one to turn to. I didn't have any family. I didn't have any friends. I didn't have anything here. And I was at my weakest moment and I didn't know what to do at all. I was breaking down. I thought I had no one. I just wanted to give up on everything and turn away from Islam. But I didn't. I kept strong. I prayed and I ended up posting an ad on Facebook asking for like immediate accommodation for me to stay. And that's when one of the brothers from the White Coats actually messaged me and said he had a sister's home for girls in need. And... A few days later I went to the home and I met a whole pile of new girls. And these girls were absolutely amazing. I was like scared to, you know, move in with these girls because I didn't know who they were. But they were so supportive. Um, I became really close with one of the girls there. I spent almost every day with her going out and I met new friends and you know, I'm learning about Islam a lot more. I like inshallah I'm getting on my deen a lot better than what I used to be and like being in this household is absolutely amazing because it's the first time I felt like home in a long, long time. And it's just amazing how these people can provide a roof over a, like girls' heads, or, like for people in need. It's absolutely amazing because I honestly felt like I had no one. And for me to live in this place now, it's finally got me back up on my feet. I'm looking for work. I'm going to study. Um, I've been getting income now and are looking for my own place and I'm doing all that. I have friends and I feel like I actually have a family and I feel really blessed to be in this house and it's just absolutely amazing and I'm so grateful for what they've done for me. Yeah.